Hey, look, so most of you guys are not subscribed, so go and do that. Also, I'm doing a giveaway right now over at my Discord server, so go and check that out. I'm not really sure how to start off this video, more than to just say that this is by far my best solo run ever, where everything just went my way. Or almost at least. The following gameplay was taken from my 20 hour run over at Face Punch Mall. I hope you enjoy. Okay, we're back in the lands of rust. Let's go. Holy compound. What the f As I said, almost. But let's speed through this dot. I found a pretty good building spot near outpost, where I could place down a starter base. But before I could finish the base, I started getting shot at. I could already tell what sort of neighbors these guys would be. After dealing with the neighbors, I made my way over to the dome for a scrap run. I depoted everything in base and then I went to see what my neighbors were up to.
fuck. Okay, Th those guys are gonna be a problem. But hopefully, I can make a play of them and get my first gun. I mean, they're definitely not very good, and <laughs> they're not going around the most geared. And I was absolutely right. After this heli came out, and a group close by was taking it. Whoever's taking heli is terrible. <laughs> Holy. and fucking that was really stupid a really stupid way to play and a really stupid way to lose our first gun yes it was a really stupid way to lose our first gun but i was only 30 minutes into this run and well it was only up from here i ran over to a shop where i bought a revolver What the... Get off the horse! <laughs> Get off the horse! <laughs> it's so laggy. <laughs> oh my god. I did satellite for a blue card. Oh. Fuck yeah. And water treatment for a red card. Then I went down into the tunnels for a quick scrap run. I ran over to our post where I recycled everything. I also used this opportunity to research up some necessary items. Someone was doing oil rigs, so I found a boat and set off to counter. Bro, let me up! Oh my god. Let me up! Oh my fucking god! Oh my god. Fuck's sake, man. No way.
a really good start to the wipe. But I felt that my base was a bit too small now. So it was time to get up the main base. Okay, so we have a few guns. Time to build the main base. Like we have basically everything we'll need for the compound and everything. As I was out farming however, I started hearing a raid close by. So I stashed most of the farm and went over to see what I could do. I get back up and ran back. Oh, how many are there? At this point, it looked like it would be one of those wipes, where I just kept getting outnumbered and outgunned. So for now, instead of PvPing, I started focusing on getting up the main base. I found this decayed base and decided to check it out. There was this space right next to my main base that was blocking me from building outer TCs. Ooh. Could be worth to use C4 for that. I mean, I need to get rid of this space anyways. It's too close to my other one. It's gonna block it. Expected, but all I need is the base. I recycled all the components I'd gotten from oil rig. I found an airdrop where I got back my C4. Okay, so so far there's been a lot of grinding and farming, but here is where our story goes from a normal wipe to an insane wipe.
Now I had an MP5, my favorite weapon in the game other than AK. Let's research explosive. Now I'm going to speed through the next hour of me playing here. I went over and did large again. I went over to Outpost where I bought a level 3 workbench using the drones. Nice. Then as I was going to Outpost to trade stone for wood, I started hearing a raid in the distance. Someone was raiding the big compound I had looked at in the beginning of the video. If I could get out with this, it would be huge. Fucking nice. Got some rockets. Why did I not take the minicopter out? I'm so dumb. I knew there were more to be won from this, so I quickly depoted and ran back. Rockets now. That's fucking huge. I'm gonna be able to do a pretty okay rate today, I'm pretty sure. And I knew exactly who I wanted to raid. My neighbors. And even though they haven't really cost me any trouble, other than the annoying welcome to the neighborhood at the beginning, I had a feeling they would become a big problem in the future if I didn't deal with them now. So I ran over there to check on their base. Their base was just an extended 2x2. Two two. And they were online, so hopefully it would be an online raid. I started preparing for the raid. Four more rockets. 
rockar. Okej, okay, let's research rocket. We can go do this raid. I researched up a rocket because I knew I would need more than 9 rockets to raid them. As I was cropping up some rockets, I started hearing a raid close by. So I ran over to check it out. That should not have been that close. <laughs> I used his explosives to finish the raid. That not enough. The... Might as well finish the raid at this point. Oh, low raid, yes, bro. Okay, now I see a bit more. I'll be absolutely loaded in there. We're lucky. So it wasn't really... I mean, yeah, okay, okay, the scrap. Yeah, okay, it was worth it. Definitely. We have a lot of components now. We have to go and recycle run soon. I knew I needed more explosives to raid my neighbors. So, I ran out on a quick farming. What the fuck is this? Really? Oh my god. <laughs> it's a fucking huge compound. It just keeps going, <laughs> what the? Oh, this compound is enormous. What the? Hopefully this is a good, good idea. I'm hoping to find a lot of sulfur in here. Bro, these guys own like... This whole thing. That's fucking crazy. The craziest thing is I haven't even seen their base yet. Oh, never mind. That's probably their base. Yeah. Definitely. <laughs> I started cooking up the sulfur. And as I was waiting for it to smelt up, Pelly came out. And a clan close by took it down.
Damn, I'm too late to down that fast. He doesn't even have the crates. I guess either the crates we just fucking... Actually, I think this was a crate. The Bolti. Yeah, the Bolti was a crate. Okay, so maybe I had a crate. They were terrible. I guess. We got one attachment. One good attachment. And the spas. <laughs> okay, so the crates were terrible. Got it. I crafted up all the sulfur to rockets. And then it was time for the raid. Okay. <laughs> Let's do it. I have no idea if this is gonna be an online or an offline. I don't really care. It's gonna be fun. Wasted a fucking T4 nice. Junk is this? Okay, wood. Wood? Anywhere? How is it? Oh. Fuck. PC is overlapping. I grabbed an inventory with loot and went back to base. Well, I mean, I'm not sure if I would call it profit, but I'm getting rid of a close by group that would definitely become a problem in the future. So I would like for one of them, or at least like one or two of them, to be online, but I'm not gonna sit here and wait for them to come online. Fuck that. I ran back to their base and sealed it.
I then transferred all of their loot to my base. I wanted to finish my base, so I went out to farm when I started hearing a raid in the distance. Of it. After this, I finished up most of the base. And then I logged off. First thing I did the next morning was recycle all the components I had gotten from the raids yesterday. I also did oil rig again. I had 5 rockets left from yesterday, so I took 4 rockets to raid a small base close by.
Where's the counters? I was beginning to think the server had died. Let's see, nope. I am really bad with LR recently. Like even with four times, I'm better with AK Hollow, even at long range. For some reason. Fucking grubs, bro. At least I got back my AK. Wonder where the pretty these guys live. They have to live close. I think that was the same guys at least. These guys, where the fuck do they live? Just keep coming. Oh, <laughs> a bit too much action for my liking, but we got back basically everything we lost. Got back the bolt, got back the AK. All I didn't get back was uh, full kit, I guess. But we did get like four rows of guns, so it adds up. Heli was out again, so I decided to take it down. Where the fuck did he just leave? Really? Oh no. He's coming back.
Fuck off! After I had lost the heli, I wasn't too happy. So, I went out to look for any bases to exploit. When I saw that the clan base I had stole the loot from yesterday had decayed. But I could already hear someone in it. I moved all the loot over from the clan base to my base. Hmm. Jesus. Then Heli came out again, and I took it. This time, no counter showed up. Yes! Okay. I mean, one C4 rocket crate. I'll have to do. At this point in the wipe, I was kinda done on the server. And I was looking for a way to end it. When I came across an active base. I decided to wait for him to come back. Oh my god. Now I feel kinda scummy for how I took this guy's loot. So I felt it would only be right to use the sulfur on him. I cooked up all the sulfur and then crafted that into rockets. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's all the fun. Could die immediately, could go very well, we don't really know. All I know is, at least one is online, they have a bunch of turrets, so we'll see, we'll see how this goes.
Are you kidding me? How can I not hear him? How, how did I not hear? I should hear him jump. You can't jump up without... I died to that. Really? Well... It's been a good run overall, like I have to say. Even though we lost there, uh, like... <laughs> I didn't think I was gonna win, I just hoped I would get further than that. Oh. Okay. Like I was, I'd say, it's been a pretty successful solo run. So... Sucks to end it with a loss, but... I'm not scripting my videos, so I can't really do anything about it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. They take a long time to make, so if you want to support me a little extra, you can do that over at my Patreon. And also I have a Twitter account where I post memes, video teasers and much more, so go and follow me over there. But I will see you guys in the next video. Peace and goodbye.